Aries, hello, good morning. Stava and Needle, my name is No. You got a few cards for you. Got a few cards for you. Yeah. Emotional realm. Yo. Perhaps you've been all up in your emotions. Maybe you should be in your emotions. Yeah. Maybe referring to um something that has been going on in your life could be in general how the world is going how your life is going um, maybe struggling it feels like you have a lot of um, struggle going on um, does not just feel like it but it's reflecting in the reading as well but um all about the emotions for you yeah that's where it starts right matters of the hearts when you care about something then you may may actually do something about some endeavor, right? Yeah, yeah. So it seems like it's a, a very good time to look inside your heart, and see what's really there. Perhaps go and look in the mirror. And ask yourself a bunch, yeah. Like, what have you done, right? What have you done in your life so far? Yeah. Must be severe on the self. That is not reflected in this card, but that's something what everybody should be doing. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. So, a strong, good look at your emotions is necessary, I feel. Yeah. Why? Because of this. That may bring a lot of in inward struggle. It may also be with somebody else. I'm not saying that it's just an on the inward, but I feel that it might be. So, uh, internal battle, I feel. Yeah. Maybe external too. Um, but um, you must work through this. Uh, if you look inside yourself and you do not like what you see, then you must ask yourself why. Why do I feel that way about this? Yeah. Constantly examining your emotions. Yeah. Also, what you do not feel. That's been a big issue for me. Yeah. <clears throat> not, not saying love and stuff, because um, I do absolutely love my wife. But there's been th things in the past uh, that really made me question, like, why don't I feel anything about this endeavor? Yeah, yeah. And getting to the core of that. Uh, that's really reflected to shadow work, really. Because you must think back and back and back and back all the way your whole life. Like, why is it? Because more likely than not, it's got to be something childhood. Not saying trauma, could be trauma, but, um, Something that happened or did not happen when you were a kid. Yeah. Yeah. Seems like you must complete that cycle. Yeah. Yeah. Also, again, um, <clears throat> referring to spiritual androgyny, bringing the masculine and feminine energies together, right? Yeah. Well, this card is a big cycle coming to a completion card, right? So it feels like you must bring um, the cycle to completion within yourself to get over this struggle, whatever that may mean for you. Yeah. Why do I feel uh, um, bringing the masculine and feminine energies together in this card? Well, again, the crossing of the legs, the crossing here, the crossing there, the four, the cube, right? Unity consciousness. Yeah. So you must um, engage your whole brain in this, not just your emotions. Very important. <clears throat> but do not leave logic out either. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And if you find some trauma, try to um, try to come to an understanding why they did what they did to you. Mm -hmm. Maybe they were feeling like that as well. Yeah, or maybe their parents were feeling like that too. 
until infinity all the way back in history. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Come into a deeper understanding of your world, right? Yeah. And the last card, that will bring you success. You, I'm not saying that's going to bring you a lot of money and stuff, but uh, as you work within yourself, if you work through all your pain and trauma, all that stuff, you will find that um, over time your life will make sense. It will fall into place. Yeah. Mm-hmm. It will make sense. Yeah. Yeah. Light at the end of the tunnel. So what this represents to me yeah. completion in a material realm well I would not say just material realm yeah I know Pentacles do um, pertain to the material but I feel it's like the completion of everything um, mind heart and willpower um, brings it full circle that's what I feel like yeah, and then you got the 10 as well, which is a uh, completion too. So, yeah. There you go. There you go. Hope you like it. Do give us a, give us a like if you do, and uh, let us know how you feel about it. And, uh, yeah, see you on the next one. Bye-bye.